So not only are we watching our first live PBA game, but we are watching the most popular team in the Philippines and a friend of Nelvin's cousin plays for them. What's going on, man? Hi. How you doing? You did awesome, bro. Thank you. Yeah. You did so good. Yes, so excited to see this guy play. And just like us, Maverick is also a Californian. <laughs> born and raised near our neighborhood in California and although we haven't officially met he was cool enough to give us four tickets to watch him play but before we head to the game we want to first introduce you to another Californian who has been exploring and vlogging about the Philippines currently he is vlogging about the top hidden gems of BGC so since we're now officially BGC citizen we're gonna show him two of our hidden gems before we head to the game and here's a quick hint guys Guys, the first hidden gem that we're about to show him has to do something with basketball. All right, guys, we have finally met JJ from Jaycation. Woo -woo. What's up, everybody? Kamusta? He's also from California and he's visiting the Philippines. We have stepped foot onto Manila, Philippines. We are back. He just got back from Boracay, is that right? Yeah, just landed off the plane and came here to see you, you four. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to be hanging out today and I just told him that I was speaking speaking to his dad on YouTube. His dad's name on YouTube is Dad Keisha. Stay in the life, stay in the life. What the? Dad Keisha yeah. and Mom Keisha. They love your channel. Yeah. They love watching YouTube grow up. They were totally following you guys. Like when I met you a couple weeks back, I was like, hey, I met a family mom dude. Did you watch them? They got all excited. They just lit up. <laughs> now, I don't watch a lot of YouTubers, but when I do, I either watch our friends always be changing. And now I'm going to be watching JK shit. But all I saw was like everyday vlogging, which is very hard to do. So how is that? How many have you done so far since you've been here? I probably filmed at least 20 videos and I've posted around half of them already. Wow. Uh, so what are your plans right now? Are you, how long are you staying here? Ooh, I got two more days left and I'm gonna be at Okada tomorrow. So we'll be doing an Okada video. Thanks for the invite. <laughs> you guys wanna come? <laughs> Buffet tomorrow night? Which one? Let's go. <laughs> um, yeah, and then I go to Korea because I'm going to watch the Padres play the Dodgers in the uh, opening series for uh, the international series. You are truly Jaycation. That is so cool. Wow. No kids, no wife. Not yet. This is, it's like the bachelor -cation. Were you born here? No, I'm actually born and raised in San Diego. And when I got to college, I learned how to speak Tagalog at SDSU. I took two years of uh, Tagalog. He's got his like Tagalog accent, but then when he speaks English, he's like pronounces every word. It's very American. Yeah. Yeah, I'm for sure like you're typical Southern Californian bro. At ito ang pinakauna na video ko sa salita akong buong video sa Tagalog. Uh, are your parents originally from Manila? Uh, my dad is from Cubao, which is here in Manila, yeah. And my mom is just 45 minutes south of here, Cabuya, Laguna. Uh, uh, born and raised? Yeah, both of them are born and raised here. My dad came to the States when he was 17. And then uh, six years later, my mom came um, after they got married. Wow. How long have you been doing YouTube for? Oh, great question. Uh, I started my page in 2015. What? I got super shy, so I didn't really get at it until like the end of 2016. But the pandemic is when my channel started to take off. Eight years of hard work. Time to unveil the silver play button. 100,000 subscribers. We got it. So Jay, we are going to be showing you two of our hidden spots. I know you're doing what? Seven or ten hidden spots? At I'll try to do ten. I'll try to get ten done. All right. So the first hidden gem in BGC that we want to show you is the Courtyard by Nike. Super cool, vibrant basketball course that opened up late last year, uh, just in time for the FIBA World Cup, which was hosted by the Philippines. A really cool thing is that at night, they have women here playing and it's all reserved for girls. Girl power! Yes! The best part is, it's all free. Everything is free. You need the Nike app first, which needs a phone, which costs money. Not sponsored. Not sponsored. Love the vibe and the art that surrounds this spot. The courts feature bright colors and bold patterns representing the feel of Manila. You can totally feel it. Reminds me of the sun, all the yellow in the court. Now it has two FIBA 
uh, regulation size basketball courts and a half court for kids. So when I take Knox here, uh, anyone that's under 16 can have their own half court. So the best thing about this is that this is very eco-friendly. The courts that you see are all made from Nike Grind, which is rubber derived from uh, about 30,000 pairs of recycled shoes. Let's try out the rubber. When I saw the people bounce the ball, it like cancels out most of the noise. I barely heard any of the noise, so it's probably because of the ground. This is such an awesome setup by Nike. I also love that uh, they have lockers for you and they have showers. So it's a full on locker room in here. And by the way, one of the most important things before you come here is that if you come here in the afternoon, then it's gonna be really packed because everybody wants to be here because it's a really nice court. And second thing is that they only allow Nike basketball. So make sure to get a Nike basketball before you come here. And to add to that, you need Nike basketball shoes. Non-Nike basketball shoes will be kicked out. Sorry, Jay. How about, how about these Game of Thrones special edition Adidas? All right, so that was the first hidden gem that we wanted to show. Jay, now let's go to the second. All right, Jay, the next hidden gem that we wanted to show you is pretty close by here. It's about two blocks away and it's right downstairs from our condo. Oh, that's awesome. Yes. Let's check it out. All right, cheers to meeting Jay Cation and to a uh, long friendship. Yeah, cheers to new yeah. friends. Yeah, yeah, new friends. Next time I'm back in BGC, we'll uh, do more. And if you ever come back to San Diego, California burritos on me. Oh, <laughs> sure. that's what I miss from California. And also, cheers to the Ginebra San Miguel. Can't wait to watch Maverick play tonight. Let's go cheers. cheers. All right, that was so much fun hanging out with Jay Cation. We wish we had more time to hang out with him, but it is about 6.50 and the game starts at 7.30 and we are about an hour away from here Guess and what? good news we just found a grab that's five minutes away right now okay good yeah, i just but got I it because our other driver had canceled uh -huh. okay so we'll meet you at the green gate i'll call i'll call you when i'm like 10 minutes away okay maraming salama po <laughs> i'm learning konti lang <laughs> it's surprised that i'm speaking <laughs> tagalog okay opo sige you guys like how I said Sige? Oh, do you guys like how I said Oppo? So this is Maverick's driver and he's got the tickets for us. So we're gonna meet him at the green gate and he's gonna hand him over. Super nice guy. Now, even though this is our first PBA game, we've actually gone and seen two FIBA games. We saw Serbia play against Italy for our first game where in uh, Knox and Nia got those free tickets off oh. Nike. Whoa. A pair of FIBA tickets. Salama, thank you, thank you so much. Ah. And then the next game, we were able to watch the semifinals of the FIBA game. We all got to go, us four, and it was at the MOA Arena. And that was fun. That was against Serbia and Canada. But uh, yeah, this would be our first, not only PBA, but Philippine Cup. And it's going to be against... Ooh, I was just gonna look it up right now. Uh, it's a company in the Philippines that we do not like because they gave Jesus. us a very high bill. Oh, electric company, our electric company. Yes, oh, electric dang, company. I was gonna see that. Right. This is so bad. Yeah, it's pretty bad. This is probably the highest electricity bill that we've ever gotten. You wanna say I it? can't say it. Okay. It is 40,815 pesos. Yes. Marcelo? Marcelo? What's the electric company called here? Uh, Meralco. Meralco. Now, for those that aren't familiar with PBA, it's a bit different than the NBA schedule. With the NBA, there's 32 teams, and uh, for the season, they play anywhere, I believe, seven to eight months. That includes the playoffs. Here in the Philippines, the pros play in three different uh, conferences, or what they call here, three different cups. They all last for four months. The most important season would have to be the Philippines Cup, which just started. The criteria for these teams, they all have to have a Filipino bloodline. 
Now the next cup would be the Commissioner's Cup and they are allowed to have imports, uh, foreigners, but the, but the foreigners cannot be no taller than 6'9". I probably wouldn't be able to play there guys because I wouldn't make the uh, criteria. I'm too tall. No, you have to. I'm too tall. And then uh, the other cup would be the Governor's Cup, same thing, you, uh, they can get an import or foreigner, but the height limit on that one for the import would be 6'6". So it is halftime, score is 46, 27. So hopefully we bring them some good luck because we came late. So let's make a comeback in the second half. So guys, this is Tyrone. He's a driver for uh, Maverick. For Maverick, yes. And he, he's the one that uh, waited for us and gave us the ticket. Maraming uh, salamat, Tyrone. Are we gonna meet Zero Zero? I hope Zero Zero. <laughs> Nia called Maverick Zero Zero. Uh, we want to meet him, hopefully, but we'll see how busy he can get. He might be tired after a long day. He might be so exhausted, but hope we can get a, like, a hello or something from him. Here's a little fun fact about this Coliseum. Now, this Coliseum, first of all, is pretty ginormous. I think it might be a little bigger than the Moa Arena, but on October 1st, 1975, this is where Muhammad Ali and Joe Frazier fought. And that's why they call it the Thrilla in Manila. Thrilla in Manila! Okay, they're blindfolding a guy, and then he gets to shoot. Oh my god! Oh, oh he was short! One more, one more! So short. One more time, one more time. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, he's got 10 seconds. He's got 10 seconds. Oh, we made it. That's hard. Alright guys, so the third quarter is about to start and we are going to have the best comeback ever. I can feel it. It's a 19 point difference, but we're going to catch up. We've got time. Come on, number zero, zero and 34. I'm going to combine our numbers. <laughs> Let's go, they just shot one. Let's go, let's go, man. What? Man made one and he got fouled. Yeah. Every point counts, every point counts. Let's work. Ginebra. Oh, bad pass. 51 to 29, not looking good. Come on. Oh, man. Come on, man. Oh. Nia. Come on. Come on, guys. Get up your game. Oh. Oh, come on. The shot. Killing me. Come Twenty-three more. Yeah. Right now, it's Ginebra forty-two and Morocco seventy-one. Two-minute warning, and they're 25 points down. Looks like we lost to our electric company. They got electrocuted like we got electrocuted. Oh. 
Oh, did they come out here? Uh, I'm just wondering who's taller, <laughs> me or uh, Maverick? Definitely not you. Let's see. Height check. I think everyone's waiting for the players to come out because that little tunnel here is where they all come in. So I'm sure everyone's just waiting to get the picture. Oh, uh, uh, nice to meet you. Hi, Rax. Hi, nice to meet you. Why are you Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Hi, thank you. Um, ano pangalan? Ian. Ian. Oh, nice to meet you, folks. Yes. <laughs> I'm waiting for the vlog. Eh? Yeah, you're gonna be in the vlog. <laughs> um, work for the team. Oh, oh yeah, work for the team. Yeah. yeah. Shout out to Ian. <laughs> We're saying hi. Awesome guy. Uh, hey Scotty, how are you? I think you know my cousins. Uh, you went to the Rafa? Rafa, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, we were just there and they were telling me about you. Yeah, yeah. What's your name? Your name's Hop. How about you? Oh, nice meeting you. Guys. There you go. Hey, pleasure. Take care. Take care. Oh, nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you. What's going on, man? How you doing? You did awesome, bro. Thank you, Arpa. Yeah. Oh, nice. Thank you. <laughs> you guys enjoy it? Uh, yeah, I mean, I wish you could have came, you know, better outcome, but. Ah, uh, it's all good. Yeah. We're like, you guys got electrocuted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man, we're, we're so tired today. We, we came from uh, back to back. Back to back. Back yeah. to back. Yeah, this is our third one. Oh, that's yeah. crazy. They man. came out fresh. So yeah, that but, third yeah. quarter, you were you guys were doing full press. Man, we had to try to switch it up. They were making everything. Oh, you know? I know. You guys stay in BGC? Yeah, yeah. 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 How do yeah. you guys like it? We love it, man. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it's, where are you at? Eastwood. Eastwood. Does your girl uh, live out here right now? No, or? she lives uh, in Santa Cruz, back home. You know? When is she coming out here? She just left. She's coming back again, maybe October. November. I'm gonna go home this after this conference, maybe uh -huh. June or July. Donald just proposed, so you might. I, be next. I know. I was like, man, you in the spot right there. I know. Hey, congrats, Donald. Bro. I know. I know. Rihanna's been waiting on. <laughs> What's your next game? Not for a long time. We have All Star Weekend. Oh, that's right. Uh, on the 21st, so 21st to the 25th, and then after that, I think. What's our next game? Thirty-one. 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 Th